Morning, girls. How are we doing? Welcome back to the Time Tito Show. This is Look at the Cuteness, and I don't know how much it's going to be of this video because the thumbnail is a baby, and like I said, I don't really... like. What, what am I going to do? Am I going to insult a baby? Potentially. That is... That's never, like, rolled out in my book, if we're being honest, but it's probably not going to happen. So, like, if it's just, like, Beck hanging out with a baby or something like that, I don't... I don't... I don't really know. Like, my level of dickheaditude, it's kind of like at a high point, but it's not that high, so I don't really know if I want to just sit there and shit on that. Uh, so I guess we'll just go and we'll see how far we get into it before we get to the next video. Let's go! Hey everyone! Hi! Um, good morning. Well, how actually, good afternoon. I've been awake for quite a while. Wow, you're um, I had to go get my nephew, CJ, because I'm yep. watching him for the day. Our okay. weight loss journey is going pretty good so far. Fantastic. I'm feeling okay about it. Okay, hold on, CJ. How come Beck, does, like, I'm assuming Beck doesn't have a Fitbit or anything like that, but how come we're not getting, like, updates on, like, the number of, like, calories Beck is eating? Because it's, like, weight loss wars. I get that. But it's, like, solely from Amber's point of view, it is, like, Amber going, like, well, yesterday I ate this, and yesterday I had this many calories. Whilst Beck, unless she's eating specifically what Amber made for also Amber, we're not seeing it. And Beck's not saying, well, I... Today at work, I did an extra couple thousand steps or anything. We're not really seeing the weight loss wars at all from Beck's point of view. Okay. Oh, hi, Beck. Amberlynn's feeling a little eh today, but you know. So you know. she's made me take over the fucking job, you know, again. Have those days. CJ and Rarity really like each other. Okay, no, don't go out there. Oh, redirect the little man. Trixie's intrigued by him too. Uh, understandable. Uh, yeah, if there's just sudden skips, it's because there is a lot of, um, it's just like, it's just non-stop baby, and it's just like, what am I, what am I gonna do? Am I gonna mock his crawling style? He's pretty shit at it, like, he wouldn't win the Olympics for crawling, like, but whatever. Um, one thing I just want to include there, I found it weird, was the, the kid obviously is starting to head outside, because the kid just wants to escape and join Gracie out in the, the, the great beyond, but, like, Amber was actually the one who, like, kind of nearly rushed over to like redirect and i was like oh i'm actually genuinely surprised at that because it's it's amber <laughs> like it's amber i thought amber's like kind of too lazy or like too thoughtless to really do that but actually didn't like back was the one who awkwardly was like filming there trying to like tell the child no don't go out there was well, like amber was the one who actually took action i was quite surprised hey guys this is actually uh, the first time you've seen me obviously all day long i woke yeah it probably yeah it's probably like the first like uh, the viewers have seen this video for a while because i think i skipped like two solid minutes there because a lot of it was just them kind of like hanging out with the baby and like playing like drumming stuff and banging stuff and all and like trying to make him smile and something and it's like w whatever content you know um it's not really the same thing i would show in my my videos because my videos are too like assholey, if I'm being honest with you. But it was like fine. It was fine. Um, Beck seems to have a good relationship with uh, CJ. Amber seemed like she was actually trying, which was surprising. But at the same time, you also have to keep in mind that Amber is, knows that she's filming this, so you don't know how she is off camera. Up, just in a really bad mood. I don't know. Oh my god. Last night I really wanted like chocolate and Pizza. ice cream and chips, and I knew I couldn't have. And those other failures would have quit, but I didn't have any of that because. I'm rest restricting myself so hard, uh -huh. by the way. If I have raccoon eyes, it's... I don't really think that would be the case. Like, if I woke up the next day after, like... Like, for example, imagine, like, the... the Find your water faster today. Imagine if I was, like... I wanted to keep doing that. And I was, like, on the fifth night being like, oh, I really want to break this. And then I didn't. On the sixth day, I woke up. I'd probably be more proud of myself than, like, still in that mindset. I'd probably be more proud of myself. It's like, oh, I did overcome that hurdle. Like, it's weird that she woke up in the same mindset. Because I had so much mascara on before I took a shower. I got out of the shower just a couple hours ago. Like my hair's you. already completely dry. And like... just mascara. <laughs> over, so. It's already completely dry. Just, you know, like, somehow. I thought you just, like, only just woke up because you're just, you're still in bed. So did you get up and then go and shower and then get back into bed with, like, wet hair or something like that? Or... Or are you lying to me about showering? Amber, I couldn't believe that would be true. You wouldn't possibly lie about me. <laughs> I do apologize. I just want to update okay. everyone. I did not eat anything extra last night. It was uh -uh. all purely just cravings, and I didn't do it. I told myself okay. that in January I'm going to be stricter this month than any other. Yeah, but then it shouldn't be the issue. Shouldn't what you be apologizing for is apologizing for making, like, your video clickbait and saying you're spilling the tea when you didn't actually spill any tea. For a month. This month is spilled water. Me and get me used to eating this in this way in this lifestyle. A lot of people believe that's, in moderation, and I yeah, that's the thing. Like, if you're trying to get used to eating in this in this way for this lifestyle change thing, shouldn't you have like 
I don't know, like cut your calories in half first and then half again, maybe that. I feel like I'll get there one day. I just need to lose some more weight and just yep. eat healthier and understand my body more. I, I do want to say that I have been weighing myself so every single times. day and I have been down weight every single day, but Monday oh will be the day that I'll weigh in and make a video. So I want to show you guys what oh I have God. for dinner tonight. So I'm just doing a- What's that? Is that the ground turkey? I assume that's ground turkey. I assume that's ground turkey with just lots of like diced um, garlic on it. Cause like, it does, like some bits of it look like turkey and then some bits of it don't look like turkey. That's the most spinach I've seen her eat. I'm really boring with spinach. Like I generally just eat spinach like this. But like, I, I guess you could like, what, 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 wilt it? I think some people fry it and all. No voiceover because I just took a picture. That's nice. We have a ton of raw spinach with some balsamic vinaigrette. I just have a serving mm -hmm. of that. We have a serving of brown rice. I know a lot of people yep. are like against carbs, but I am eating complex carbs and complex carbs are well yeah well i think more the risk reason people have an issue with carbs is because a lot of people probably think you should be doing like the dr Nye diet or like the, the keto diet because those are like incredibly effective but like like her especially back then this is before she like learned she had lipedema instead of just lymphedema because somehow that makes a difference but like she claimed that lipedema you can only lose weight if you're on keto even though like she hasn't done keto a single time since and is claiming like massive weight loss since then, I guess. Um, but yeah, I think most people are trying to say that keto would just be really good for you. But like a lot of like the big girls or big guys, they just don't like keto because they like their carbs too much. Are good for you. So please don't be mad at me. And that stuff right there in the middle is actually tilapia. I made it in a pan and I actually prefer oh, fish. it this way. Oh, it might okay. not be the greatest, but it was amazing. I just put some seasoning, Mrs. Yeah. Dash, some garlic. It was really, really good. And over there, we got some garlic and mushrooms. Tonight's okay. dinner was actually... Of course, garlic. I, I, you know, I should have told that was the garlic as opposed to this, because I thought the these like, chunks were garlic, but again, it's just flaky fish. Like, look at the size of those garlic chunks. You bite into them. That has a fucking powerful explosion of garlic in your mouth. Really amazing. This is one of my favorites that I have made. Okay, you guys. So today, I have done pretty bad with exercise. I've been spending uh -huh. a lot of time with this fellow right here, which I don't mind. <laughs> that... Which... I don't mind. Okay, please. I, I was giving you some praise for earlier on. Don't make me take it back. Come on. You were doing pretty well earlier on. Also, like, I think looking after a baby, especially the babies that are crawling around the place and all, like, uh, that was, she should probably be a good excuse, especially when your exercise is walking. Like, literally, all you're doing is walking. It's not like you're like, well, fuck, I couldn't, like, do my, my fucking... 200 kilogram squats because I was worried about the child wandering off when I wasn't looking. You know, it's not like that. Aww. You want me to pick you up? <laughs> he loves to be picked up. So I haven't been able to do like my uh -huh. legs stand zone. I haven't been able to walk. I haven't really done much of any walking. I guess I did yep. over 6,000 steps and you're walking nine. 2.5K, which is like 2,500. So that makes me feel kind of sad. Okay. Yeah, okay. Well, firstly, you are just going to have days like that. But it's weird that she keeps using the figure. I did over 6,000. Like she, cause like yesterday was, I did way, I, like I, before the, like the day was even finished, she was way over 6,000. Now it's just like, you know, I did over 6,000 yesterday. Now it's kind of like downgraded. Oh, are you my uh, angel? Yeah. Twinkies is looking at back being like, this bitch talking to me. <laughs> So I just wanted to add something really quick. Um, uh -huh. I noticed some of the comments on some, some of Amberlynn's things that, you know, uh, may feature my- Beck, okay. There's like an inch here. There's not enough there. Come on, come here. Drop that down a wee bit there. I know you're probably self-conscious about the chins, but I, 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 you look weird. It looks like you're like popping up like over a wall. Hey, hi there. Hi, how are you? <laughs> my nephews or uh -huh. a random family member, and you guys have a problem with that, and you think my family has a problem with that, but they don't. Okay. They know what Amberlynn does for a living. Uh -huh. They're fine with it. They're okay. fine with my nephews being on there. They don't care. Yes. He's got permission. Okay. So... It's not really that big of a deal. They consider her- a This feels like a hostage film, by the way. It feels like a hostage film, like Amber is just off screen with a gun being like, read the script. <laughs> read the script to them to say that I'm allowed to show off your nephew on camera and stuff like that. Well, that should be obvious because Beck was filming the nephew earlier on. So this seems unnecessary. I don't know what the discourse was back then. Obviously to really properly comment on it. But my kind of thought process is, if Amberlynn is such a divisive, sorry, um, character, she's probably not someone I think you would want to include a young child in, you know? Like, there's always been, like, issues with, like, young children on YouTube anyway. Like, you know, fucking Dory Doesn't, I'm sure, is, like, an example of that. Daddy 05, um, the Angry Grandpa show. There's always been that element of, like, extortion. There's no, like, there's no one there, like... The, the parents are the ones seemingly and oftentimes doing the extorting. 
So there's no one there to look after the child's interest as like a neutral third party like they would be on like a film set. Like on a film set, there generally is a party there to make sure that the child is being treated right, that the child is not being abused, is not being made to work too much, has uh, plenty of breaks. That kind of, that, that's what happens on film sets. But the problem is you're trusting Amber, who a lot of people really dislike and think is a terrible person with a, a young child, and she's showing it off, especially like... People are probably thinking ahead. It's like, well, imagine, like, in a couple of years, that kid's at school and people, like, you know, like, someone, like, crazy troll finds out, oh, the, you know, you were in this woman's video. That's you there. And, like, bullies them for it. I think that's what people's concern probably is. It's probably less to do with your family and more to do with their own feelings. It's part of the family now. So that's why wouldn't quick. she want to vlog her family? Hold you, quick. Toledo. For Becky and I, it's been kind of a long day. Hi, hi, thumb. Thumb. Can we, can we... Whoop, up there we go. Thanks. DJ is literally a joy to be around, but definitely a handful. It's wow. it's eye opening. How See, the problem is, like I said, I was giving her like Priya's earlier on, and then the way she got on, I was like, no, how do you be able to exercise because of him? You know, like it's like okay, but bad look already. Then you wheel out Beck to basically do the hostage video of like how Amber is definitely allowed to, and it's basically a member of the family, and it's totally okay. And then it cuts to her being like, oh wow, he's such a handful. It's like ah. Oh. Some of this kind of feels staged now that you were only doing this to be like, look how good I am with kids. It feels like it was that. Oh, that's sad. Oh, well, you know, much work a baby really truly is. I'm sorry if this vlog bored you guys. Stop I fucking yourself! Go now. <laughs> oh my god, fantastic. Uh, I hope you guys still enjoyed and I'll I didn't. It was uh, pretty, pretty mid. <laughs> Stop I fucking yourself. I'm sorry. It's just like, she's just like trying to talk about like... It really makes you think about what it's like to have a baby uh, the whole time. Chin pose, curl the hair, flick the hair, touch the face. It's just like non-stop. It's like, bro, I, I fucking get it. Okay, on to the next video. Okay, guys, we are here with so many temptations. Oh, my God, so many temptations. Ch chocolate and whole wheat bread or whatever it was that she was after. You know, all those other failures, they would say just give it and have chocolate, but not Amber. Amber's too strong for that. Amber will resist. She'll never have chocolate a day in her life again. I guess we're just going to get into it. I just want to kind of know what weight we're going for here. She said she's lost weight every single day because she's weighing herself every single day. But it's like forbidden knowledge. We're not allowed to hear about it until some point, I guess. Hey, guys. Hello. So I just woke up a little bit ago. I was so, so very yeah. tired. We actually had to wake up quite a bit earlier than usual. And oh, my God. You had to wake up at noon? Oh, my God. That's insane. <laughs> I, I want her to explain to me what she means by we had to wake up because back works beck has a job okay so like I, I don't know what time beck starts work i don't know what beck actually did as a job but i know beck has a job because i made a point that beck has a job so like i don't know what beck does like maybe beck needs to be up at like 9 a.m what, what what what's we had to get up at a certain time i'm genuinely curious we had becky's eight month old nephew sleeping with yep, us i know which honestly he is a major joy but it's like you don't realize how much work a baby really is, but I... She is so negative about this fucking baby. <laughs> I just can't believe I was giving her praise. She's so fucking negative. I can't believe how much work it is. It's like, no, I, I, I can. It's a baby. It's a, a little human that you have to look after. Have you ever had a puppy? Puppies are lots of work. Babies are more work. I love him. He's adorable. So over Christmas time, Becky has a few different ways that she celebrates Christmas. Okay. And one of them is with her mom and her uh, sisters. Oh, unusual. But her mom got really, really sick, so we couldn't do Christmas then. So we're actually going to do it today. Okay. So I'm super, super pumped about wow. that. The kicker is <laughs> they're going to be having Little Caesars pizza there that just aren't in my uh, lifestyle change. Why do you look jaundiced? <laughs> she looks fucking yellow in my lifestyle change. Fantastic. That, that's really going to stop. You could just not have it. I'm sure Little Caesars probably has. I don't know. A solid menu? Maybe a solid menu? Maybe you could get like a small personal pizza because a small personal pizza would certainly be under 1,800 calories, especially if that's your limit. Like a small personal pizza. Like if you get like a small, like we want to be four size pizzas, you could probably get a, a pizza that's like 700 800 calories maybe probably, probably less than that if you if, depending on the toppings you go for like yeah you 100 percent could go out you could still have pizza you could still actually celebrate with them without like can be like well it's not within my calorie li limit so i might as well get a three stack double cheese stuffed crust massive pizza uh well it's not in my calories so i might as well just splash out this one time for january so i'm actually gonna be okay. making 
my own meal to take with me to warm up there. No, you're not. You're not. Okay. I, do I, I had an idea that, that like, how, how dare I think they're being sociable. I had an idea that they're going to Little Caesars because apparently Beck's family's obsessed with Little Caesars because they got her Little Caesars gift card. Which What, what happened to that gift card? Because she, she claimed she didn't use it, but it's, apparently it's still floating around. So are you going to use that now for this? I'm going to keep an eye on you because you did have that Little uh, Caesars gift card and you claimed that you didn't use it and had $10 on it. But are they, like, are they obsessed with Little Caesars? Because that's like everything's Little Caesars related for them. I'm kind of embarrassed about it, but I don't want to sure. derail any of the progress that I've already made. Well, okay. Well, surely, like, Beck's going to be doing the same because Beck's attending with you. Like, so surely, that's a lot of chicken breasts. Is this just for, like, one meal? Like, I'm curious. Like, tomatoes, fine, everything. Okay. Okay, so she's meal prepping for a while. I thought all of those chicken breasts were for that one meal. I was like, what the fuck? Okay. Surely you should be bringing one of these for back as well, because back can't derail. Um, veggie pasta with chicken and shrimp, and there's tons of veggies. Looks fine. Broccoli saw, asparagus. There's tons of veggies. There's a, a bit of, like, vegetables. Like, I guess it's like, if you're including tomato sauce, I don't include that as a vegetable. <laughs> tomato sauce. It has asparagus and some cut up, like, cherry tomatoes in it. Isn't that right? Is that, is that, that was it. It's mushrooms, tomatoes. Oh, yeah, mushrooms. So these are for when we go to her mom's house, which is going to be... Are work. mushrooms technically a vegetable or are they a fun guy? Mm, I'm asking that because I'm quite a fun guy myself. <laughs> the worst thing I've ever said. I apologize. Day later tonight, I'm talking like probably like about five, six hours from tonight when we'll uh -huh. actually eat this. And I got us a serving for now to eat. Fantastic. I'm currently eating and doing my makeup at the exact Wait, you're going to reheat prawns? That's not something I would do. Reheating prawns just sounds like you're playing Russian roulette. Same time, because we're running a little bit behind. Okay. But my question for you guys is, yeah, I'm like mid-makeup. Oh my God. It doesn't hide your chins. I'm sorry to break it to you. I can still see them past your fucking hands. <laughs> like, okay, remember this is the woman who said I couldn't film me making the tacos, but here's the entire recipe because I'm too busy. But apparently they're ru already running late to go to Beck's mom's, like, celebration that they missed because, you know, like, she was so super sick over Christmas, even though we didn't hear about that, like, whatsoever over Christmas. But it's just like, oh, but never mind. I'm going to sit here and I'm going to vlog for a while whilst I should be doing my makeup and eating at the same time. That's how far behind I am. I don't mind that. Do you guys like the texture of asparagus? Because I think... Like, come on. Really? Really? Like, really? Guys, I'm, we're, so, we're already so far behind to try and get to meet, go on meet Bex's mom. I'm even eating whilst making my, whilst doing my makeup at the same time. However, I'm going to pause all of that to say, because I feel like asparagus, like, uh, I'm not sure. Bro, is this really the pressing question we needed to know, like, right fucking now? It was, like, too important you needed to ask for this video that's going to be edited and posted more than likely well after your meeting, so you could just ask it fucking afterwards if you really wanted to. Yeah, I think she, I, I think she's not, that's deliberate. This is a power play thing. And it's just like, it's your family. I don't care about your family. Fuck you. Yeah, fuck your family. The texture is so gross. Asparagus yeah. is super healthy for you. So I kind of deal with it, but yeah. the texture is no. What do you have to say about that, Rebecca? Uh, <laughs> Thanks, Beck. <laughs> she's a fucking cave, man. Um, fantastic. Maybe she's, maybe how she feels about it is, I don't care. Hurry the fuck up. We're already running late for going to see my mom. I put on my finest SpongeBob t-shirt to go and see my mother. <laughs> Back to was a fucking train wreck. You like it? Yeah, I like it. I think this is one of my- I like it. Huh? You like it? Yes, I like it. <laughs> They're so awkward together. Like meals that you've made. Really? You say that literally every fucking time, Back. Even I don't believe it now. And I believe everything Amber tells me. Yeah. Well, we're having it again for dinner. Great. <laughs> this is only like eight months into the relationship and beck is already this beaten down where she's like yeah it's so good i love it yeah it's best it's the best meal you've ever made yeah i'm looking forward to having it again fantastic like she is so beaten down so I wasn't... That chair did not sound happy. Amber, fucking abort right now. Get the fuck off that chair. I wear my hair in a braid, but I don't okay. know. I decided not to. Just We're running behind. I don't know what hairstyle I should... No one cares. Look at Beck. She's wearing a fucking SpongeBob t-shirt. No one's going to be looking at you. They're all going to be looking at her. It didn't look as good as I thought it would. Wow. But I am wearing earrings. I decided to wear earrings. I, unlike you. Digging them. These are one of Becky's favorite earrings that I have. So we are almost ready, you guys. Wow. I just I'm so excited. Today. 
Her chin looks small. I remember in like uh, uh, the last episode, I mentioned that her chin looks bigger than it does now, um, but it doesn't anymore. That's like her chin now looks definitely looks smaller, and this is without all the filters. Now that lipstick is on, I gotta go put on my shoes. I, I just but love it. I'm sorry. Like we are rushing here. We're so far behind. I'm gonna put my uh, lipstick on, and I'm going to. Why? What? Well, do you see these earrings here? It's like, oh my god, you're such a bitch. CJ in his little car seat. Yeah, I said your name. Look at him. Look at you. That's his little pack and play. He slept in that last night for half of the night, and then for the other half of the night, he slept with us. So we are bringing a tons of yep, games that's to play what with her family in her duffel bag. We got okay. our food, also brought us a kind bar each. I'm kind of curious, like, why? Like, why was he, was he staying with you? I'm just, that, that's more interesting for me than, like, the fact that he was staying with you. Is, is it, like, a regular occurrence? You seem to be living with each other for a while, and you're acting like it's the first time that it's ever happened. Or was there, like, a family emergency or something like that? Which, obviously, she doesn't need to tell us. She doesn't want to. But, like, I'm more interested in the why than the what. And a double bag each, water, a branded all water his stuff, his pack and play, all his yep. stuff right there. Yep. I'm gonna be honest, you guys. This feels like parents for 24 hours. Like we were it feels like parents for 24 hours. Back doing all the work and me standing there filming it. <laughs> we're parents for 24 hours, and I want to say, wow, I are not give ready. Props to parents out You're there. not ready. You guys are amazing. How do you do it? We just. I, I give props. I'm, should I even go there? Is that in bad taste? I'm not going to go there. It's in bad taste. Referencing her mother and father. Parents are so incredible. You know, all that kind of... I'm just... I'm not. I'm not. I'm a, I'm a good Christian boy. Just got back from hanging out wow. with her family, and we had so much fun. Well, clearly someone didn't have fun. What are we doing? Well, look, look there. So, look. Hanging out. So, so you clearly didn't have it. With her family, and we had so much fun. We played a game, uh -huh. and we got some gifts, which I'll show you later if I remember. And you didn't eat your dinner, which implies when they were eating their Little Caesars pizza, you probably had the Little Caesars pizza, and now you're having your dinner once you got home. Okay, sorry for all the noises. The dishwasher's going, the microwave's going. I don't know if you guys can hear uh, me, which I'm sure you can. I but can. I ended yeah. up only having a kind bar while I was there, so I'm no, just you... now warming up. Why are you lying to me? Why would you? Look, she can't even look at the camera here. Like, okay, so you, you give it. I would much rather, this is what, this is the biggest issue with Amberlynn, is I would much rather people just be honest. It's like the lying about the weight thing. I've always said, I don't care what her weight is. I genuinely don't. She could be 700 pounds, and I'm like, okay. If she's a good person, okay, whatever. I don't give a fuck what your weight, I don't care. But like, it's a, it's the weird thing where you clearly are lying to me about it or making it like a storyline and then trying to act like a, like a like a superstar that you're giving people diet advice and you're an example for people to follow. That's all the negative stuff I can't abide by. Like, if she was just, like, honest and said, you know what, guys? Yeah, actually, you know, once I was there and the pizza was in front of me, it was it was too difficult, and I had a couple slices. I didn't have too many, but I didn't have a couple. I would respect that so much more than, well, when everyone was eating pizza, I decided to only eat a cereal bar. It's like, fuck away off. Up my food to eat. I am so starving. I am sure really pumped. Actually, Beck uses the one microwave. Oh, so Beck didn't either. But both you and Beck are like, nah, didn't want with all this pizza in front of us. We're each gonna have. We're not even gonna have our dinner. We're just gonna have a cereal bar. So that means you both had pizza, and then you're just gonna have this afterwards because you're hungry and you want a snack. Mine's already done. So I'm gonna. Oh, just, you just delete the stuff. I really just do that. You did. Thank you. But yeah, I am super pumped to eat this. Oh my. Why did you put, you just picked that up off the floor. Why did you put it there? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I love she like is proving a point. Look at me. Oh, look, I do dropped that. I am immediately going to pick it up. I am so clean and I am so hygienic. And she picks up the shit and instantly just puts it on the counter. That was just on the floor and now it's on the counter. Goodness. Why do you bite the spoon? No? Just look how delicious Hello, you. breasts. How are you doing? We're just hanging out down here. Would you like to, I don't know, clean yourself in any way? There's a bit of a stain going on there. It actually looks like it might be like a cigarette burner or something like that. Because um, I've had, had, like, burns before. Back when I used to smoke. Like, if you ever had, like, the tip, like, fall off, like, the tip of the ash fall off and land on you, sometimes it would create, like, little burns like that in, in, your, in your clothes. Guys, I don't understand. See? Because it's not, like, the pattern. It, it stops there. So it looks like it's all blurred together. So it looks like... I don't know, it might be, a, it might be a, a really thick stain, maybe. Or it could be, because it doesn't look like a pattern. Or it could be a burn. I don't know. I'm sorry, I'm just, I'm just, I was looking. Okay, guys, you caught me. I was just, I wanted any reason to talk about Amberlynn's breasts for a while. Just keep them on screen. 
Oh. Rarity. Hi, Rarity. Hi. What are you doing? Being disturbed by you, probably. <laughs> Guess what time it is. I don't know. Way in time, maybe? It is time TV. to get a movie? my walk on. Oh, so I'm my on God. Look how many movies you have here that you could just be fucking watching whilst walking as opposed to watching some crazy woman walk in place whilst you also walk in place, which sounds nuts. Little TV, turn on my Blu-ray. My little TV? I, I I don't know if she's just like smug or condescending or what. It's a perfect, it's, is it the biggest TV in the world? No. It's a perfectly reasonable TV. How about you dust that in any way? I love you can see where a cable used to, like a wire used to be lying on or something like that. You can see the wire mark. Like, it's not a small TV. My little TV, it's not a small TV. And we're going to walk. Fantastic. You ready? Ready as I'll ever be. Wow. <laughs> Baby, huh. wanna get your music ready? Wow, okay. She's moving the cat. Good, toys. yep. <laughs> So many cat toys. This is such. I want to know the layout of this of this house because it is just. It looks so weird, and we've just got this giant ass room here that is just kind of like full of just Amberlins, like cast offs, and there's huge empty spaces in the floor and all. So this like, is what are you using? What, what, okay, you know what I said last time that I don't believe her that this is the first time she's watched something on this TV. I do actually like believe her now because there's no like sofa or like chairs or anything in front of this. Is this why they sit on the floor all the time? Are they used to it? Do they sit on the floor to sit and watch this TV? This is Leslie Sansone. Hello. Hi. It's nice to meet you. Hello. Heart healthy? I'd like you to tell me more about your fucking wig and Botox. That looks like a wig. Look at Walking that. Home. Look at that. It looks like a fucking I got wig. too many. Oh, fuck me sideways. I come out like a jump scare. Walk and walk and walk. You're literally walking in place, guys. Did you need a video to teach you how to walk in place? It's walking in place. Like, look, it's not even like they're doing anything different. Like, I thought, okay, maybe they're doing, like, maneuvers or something like that. It's like, walk backwards for a while. Do high knees for a while. Do, um, like, a high knee sideways raise kind of thing. You know, if you can even picture what I'm trying to describe there. Like, anything like that. Do a skip. I don't know. Do a bear, a bear crawl. <laughs> do the worms. Anything like that. But it's not. It just needs to be, like, walking in place. And like, sometimes they look like they sidestep. It's just like, oh, walk. It's okay. So sometimes they sidestep. You, do you need someone to tell you? Uh, sidestep, guys. How about you just watch a normal movie and every five minutes of the normal movie, you sidestep for a minute. There you go. Wow. Fantastic. That was amazing. I'm so glad we got to see all that. Oh, Jesus. Ready to go. It is like the most half-assed chase I have ever <laughs> seen. Wasabi doesn't give a fuck, and I respect that. Wasabi's just like, what's happening? Look at him over there. Oh, there he goes. There he ah, goes. let him go. Oh, he just stands out. Oh, oh, oh. oh. That's a no-no word, Amber. I'm recording that. I'm writing that down in my journal. You said a no-no word. You said the Lizzo word. Oh, that was a thump. That was very aggressive by Wasabi. Over there. Wasabi's like, no, I'm good. Oh, no. Wrapping paper, yeah. et cetera. You guys, so tomorrow is okay. weigh-in day. I do weigh myself oh, I'm every so excited. Day, but tomorrow is like my official weigh-in day. Oh my God. So every Monday I'm going to weigh-in. Fantastic. And I'm going to film a weigh-in video. You guys probably won't see that until Monday night or the next day, Tuesday, when I schedule it to go up at 1 p.m. Eastern time. But we'll see how I'm feeling. You probably won't see it until Monday night or Tuesday when I usually schedule it to come out at 1 p.m. It's like, so not Monday night then, just Tuesday because you schedule your videos to come out every day at 1 p.m. So it's hardly going to be out. Monday night. Why? Why do I even say that? That was just weird. Going tomorrow. I know it's gonna be a really good weigh-in because I haven't weighed myself every day, and I am down weight every single day, so I'm super excited about wow. that. Wow. And I'm I know I get a lot of questions about the chin thing, and I think it's literally just a habit. No rhyme, no. No, it's good. Look, look at that. She looked glad on the side, smirking away. But no, it's because you think it makes you look cute. That's it. Reason my hand just kind of is magnetized to it. I know this is uh -huh. a really short vlog, but I still hope you guys enjoyed it. It was like fine i guess i guess it's gonna be a fairly short video but it was like entirely fine i guess um a bit too much the kid stuff i guess in the in the first bit uh i kind of do just want to know like her, like her her honestly say that she did just have pizza there there's no way you went there and it's like well i cooked a, me a separate meal so we could take that and have that there actually no i decided not to i decided we're just gonna have a cereal bar and not eat until we got home I was like, why would you do that it doesn't even feel like you're celebrating 
and having dinner with everyone if you're just having a random fucking breakfast bar. So in no way do I believe it, like, whatsoever. Uh, but, yep, that's going to be it, guys. Really short video this time, but sometimes I like that. Have a good one. Take care of yourselves. Bye-bye.